So just as the credit crunch started in the property sector, you could argue that the Chancellor's put it as the centrepiece of the recovery as well. Um, Helped by has been a major headline grabber over the last few months, but there have been a lot of concerns about that inflating the market. As a result, you saw the Chancellor this time round defending his, uh, his scheme and making sure that people were aware that the Bank of England has uh, responsibility for um, guarding against asset bubbles. And also you saw him diverting a bit of the blame towards foreigners with uh, the introduction of uh, capital gain tax. Slight suggestion there that, uh, that actually the destabilisation is caused by overseas investors. Um, industry will, will start to say that this wasn't really a massive game changer. Um, capital gains tax over, uh, over many years won't have a huge impact on any property in particular. However, it might have uh, an impact on the stock overall as foreign buyers keep hold of their properties for a little bit longer. However, on the supply side, the Chancellor will be keen to point out that he's pushing down to as low a level as possible, um, enabling and financing of, uh, of new house building. So, for example, uh, he's introduced a, a billion pound loan to help unblock stalled sites in the north. He's produced a, a, a 300 million pound facility for uh, borrowing against the HRA, which has been quite a successful mechanism for council house building in, in recent years. Um, in addition, he's asking councils to sell off their high value uh, vacant uh, stock, which allows us to rebuild and, uh, and as long as it's ring fence could be quite an effective measure. Perhaps the least noticed point though was that the Chancellor hinted at the possibility of bribing local communities with money that would go right into the bank accounts of local people. That means not going to the local council, not going to a LEP, it goes right to local people directly. That could be a very effective measure in the future and it will be music to the ears of Nick Bowles. Um, however, on the whole, I think that this was not a huge game changer in, uh, in the property world, but we will be looking for quite big moves over the next year as we move closer to the election.